Welcome to How It's Done. Today I will show you how to create amazing map animation in CapCut. And it's all free. So let's get started. You can download world map then import it. A location icon and an airplane. You can find the location icon and the airplane in CapCut stickers. The first thing we need to do is add the world map in the timeline. Then drag your location icon to the timeline above the world map. Resize it and place it at where you want so I will place mine at New Zealand. Then again drag the location icon to the timeline and put it above the first location icon. Resize it and place it at another location. So I will place my second location on Greenland. And now we need to go to text and add a default text to the timeline above the second location icon. Now go to the right hand side where the text area is and type dash. Then go to the video player and rotate it to be in between your first and second location. Now under text scroll down till you find curve. Select curve and as you can see the dash line is curved on the video player. Then adjust you can how you want it to look. Now position the dash line and you can add or delete some of the dash line. Extend the text to match your footage is on the timeline. Also we need the dash line to be behind the location icon. Right now it's above the location. We just need to move it on the timeline below the location icon. After that, right click on the text and click on Create Compound Clip. Once you are done then go to Video. Click on Mask and select Horizontal Mask. Then on the video player, rotate your mask until your dash line disappear. Now we need to add keyframe. So add your first keyframe then. In your timeline, move your playhead to where you want your animation to end. Then rotate your mask till you can see your dash line. CapCut will automatically add a keyframe for you. If it doesn't, then just add a keyframe. Now I am going to play the map animation. We have to add the aeroplane image to timeline. So just drag the aeroplane image to the timeline. Resize it and place it at where the dash line. Animation starts so I will place it at New Zealand. And now I am going to make an animation with the aeroplane using keyframe so go to the start of the footage. Then add your first keyframe. Now move your aeroplane to follow the dash line animation. So now we are done adding keyframes and I am going to play the animation. Please don't forget to subscribe. 